This is Yemen's province of Amran, which has been fiercely bombarded by Saudi Arabia, like many other Yemeni regions. Press TV carried out a failed visit to a cement plant in Amran. The factory was bombed and destroyed by the airstrikes. Observers say this kind of attack reveals Riyadh's attention to destroy the infrastructure of the impoverished Arab country. Most of the country's infrastructure has been destroyed. This besides the government buildings and residential areas. And to add salt to the injury, they destroyed cement factories. Bombardment of the country's cement factories in the provinces of Amran, Dala and Taiz has doubled the prices of cement in Yemen. Due to the bombardment of Amran cement factory and other national cement factories and the Saudi siege and the imports of the different materials, the price of cement has skyrocketed because of the Saudi siege and the imports of different materials. It's a real crime against these poor people. Cement factories were not the only target of Saudi warplanes. They also bombed food plants to create what many people here say more hunger in the country, which has seen tight siege on the import of basic necessities and commodities. The Saudi aggression against Yemen continues despite a self-declared ceasefire. Riyadh had already violated several ceasefires in Yemen. The onslaught has claimed nearly 4,900 lives and displaced more than a million Yemenis. It is an all-out war waged by Saudi Arabia against the civilians in the impoverished Arab country. Rights activists say Saudi rulers should be taken to international criminal court for crimes against humanity. Mohammed Al-Attab, Press TV, Amran Province.